Good afternoon. My name is Henry Bullock, and on this show today, we answer the question, does the Australian youth draw inspiration from the Anzac spirit? Can you hear Australia's heroes marching? Can you hear them as they march into eternity? There will never be a greater love There just couldn't be a greater sacrifice There just couldn't be Can you hear Australia's heroes marching? The ones who fought and gave their all of the 25th of April 1915, a new world was born. A new side of man's character was shown. The Anzac spirit was created. It flared with a previous unknown, almost like a superhuman strength. There was determination, a drive, which swept the Anzac spirit up from the beach to Gallipoli Peninsula with a torch of freedom and pride for the nation. But the Anzac spirit is not just confined to the battlefield. It lives in schools, on the sports field, in the workplace, and having the values to do our best, whatever the situation is. I believe the Anzac spirit is alive in every Australian today. The Anzac spirit is not something we can see, but a powerful driving sensation that can only be felt, and is felt differently by every individual. The Anzac spirit is a flame that burns forevermore in the heart of every Australian, as today we stand safe and free with all privileges and rights. The Anzac spirit defines us as Australians. In the end, the Anzac spirit is qualities that we are inspired by. To find out whether the Anzac spirit really does inspire young Australians, I'm going to ask four everyday Australians to see what their view on the topic is. First up, Eastport Museum. Can you hear Australia's heroes marching? Can you hear them as they march into eternity? There will never be a greater Just couldn't be a greater sacrifice that just couldn't be. What do you think the spirit is? Well, I think it was then, and I think it is now. Uh, basically, determination, uh, courage, good humour. Australians like a joke, uh, even in adversity. Uh, and um, being versatile, Australians I think are terrifically versatile, they can, they can uh, cope when uh, things go strange uh, in a way that uh, a lot of other countries don't. Um, do you think that the Australian youth today are inspired by the Anzac spirit? Or? I think so. Um, I served in Baghdad in 2006 and uh, there were a lot of young soldiers there and uh, they seem to me to be exactly those things, uh, very versatile. Um, I serve with Americans as well and uh, Americans will actually stop when something goes wrong and uh, wait, for the somebody, wait for somebody else to come along and fix it. Australians will get the bailing wire out and the gaff tape and do it themselves. Um, do you think the Anzac spirit is still represented in the Australian culture? Sure. Uh, I don't think it's changed much over a hundred years. Uh, I think Australians still are a pretty tough nation. Um, they've still got a great sense of humour, they've still got that sense of mateship, uh, versatility, and of course they like a joke. That's your time. Pleasure. Next up, St John's College, my school, to ask a few questions to my associate teacher, Mr Craig Beck. Welcome Mr Beck, he's our associate teacher at St John's College. Um, thanks for being here. Um, what do you believe the Anzac spirit is? The Anzac spirit is really the epitome of mateship, something that has been a foundational part of the Australian uh, psyche uh, since the moment of, the inception, of its inception. It's really the epitome of people working side by side and fighting and bleeding for each other. The Australians and New Zealanders were, uh, were f fighting towards a common goal and they really supported each other in the trenches in the darkest possible moments of their lives and they bled for each other. And that is really a, a strong part of mateship, being there for the man next to you. Thank you. Do you believe the Anzac spirit still inspires 
young Australians today. Most certainly does, yes. Um, this whole concept of mateship is uh, a fundamental part of who we are as, as Australians and really gives, um, gives young Australians and um, just general Australians the desire and the ability to go anywhere, be anywhere and really be there for their common person and really uh, help each other as much as possible. Thanks for the time. Thanks for the time. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.